Peachtree Complete 2011 and above add new usability improvements that help reduce the time it takes to record job-related entries and improve job reporting consistency. Let's begin by looking at the data entry improvements offered in 2011. When assigning a transaction to a job, you now only need to enter the job information on the first line item row. The job ID entered on the first row will then populate subsequent line item entries automatically. This can save you the time normally spent selecting the same job for each line item on a transaction. Next, if you normally navigate a task entry window using your keyboard instead of your mouse, you will be pleased to know that the steps taken to select a job, phase, or cost code have been enhanced. With the job field selected, press your spacebar or your question mark key to display the job lookup list. Then, using the up and down arrow keys of your keyboard, you can navigate your list of jobs. To expand and collapse a job's phases list, use your right and left arrow keyboard keys, respectively. Use these keys to expand a phase's cost code list as well. When the required job, phase, or cost code is highlighted, simply hit Enter to have it populate the job field. Peachtree 2011 also makes it easier to find the correct job by including the customer ID assigned to each job in the job lookup list. In addition to making data entry easier, Peachtree 2011 also helps you reduce errors in your job reports by warning you if you have forgotten to enter job information on a purchase or sales transaction. This feature is very useful if every transaction you create is expected to be assigned to a job and you want to make sure that no transaction is overlooked. To enable this feature, enter the job's default window by selecting Maintain from the File menu, Default Information, and then Jobs. On the General tab, you can select to have the program warn you when saving customer transactions, vendor transactions, or both. With this option enabled, let's exit Job Defaults and attempt to save a purchase transaction with a line item not assigned to a job. Note that the prompt only warns you that a line is not assigned to a job. You can click OK to save the transaction anyways or click Cancel and correct the error. Thank you for taking this Anytime Learning topic. For information on additional training options available, visit us at sageu.com.